Hello everybody and welcome to yet another advent calendar video. Today we are officially in double digits. Wait, no wait, am I? Is this build 10 or 9? Now I'm not sure. Anyway, doesn't matter, we are making great progress on our island. And as the title and the thumbnail of this video suggests, I am making a gift wrapping station today. And I thought it would be nice to include Abel's in this build because I did want to include Abel's on this island, but I wasn't really sure what else to do for Abel's in case I wanted to include it on this island. So I thought this would be a nice idea. I could definitely see Abel and Sable wrapping all kinds of presents for people and f for the kids because I was watching a was I watching a scavenger hunt stream of one of my friends of Cootie Doon for Toss for Toys. And I thought this build could also function as that, you know, where presents are being gift wrapped for, for Toys for Tots. And yeah, so that's what we are building today. I am also going in Abel's later to buy the dress they were all struggling to find in that particular stream yesterday. And I was lucky enough to catch it in this video. If you look closely, you can see it in the window. So I did went in and bought it to put in front of the stall. We will see that later. For anybody, for, for any future persons that will do a Christmas scavenger hunt and will and that has that item as one of the items they need to find. At least I'll know that it will be, yes, that it will be in the dream address once I set the DA. So, you know, at least at, le I, I, at least did everything I could to make it a little bit easier on people. But going back to the topic of Toys for Tots, I thought having these cardboard boxes in front here would look nice. Maybe it's, maybe there are boxes full of stuff that people donated that still need to be looked through or that still need to be wrapped. And that's why I also put in the office materials because it kind of looks like rolls of wrapping paper and tape. So I thought it would be fitting. And a little bit of a disclaimer, the gifts that you see me struggle with here, they are going to change slightly in position because uh, I really wanted a tree behind there and with the way I had these items placed I didn't have enough space to put one in so it is going to change around a little bit and I also thought the dessert carriers would be cute in this build because they kind of do look like packaging I, I know it's the item is called dessert carrier, but if you if we would just pretend that we don't know that it could also look like a cute gift bag, right? And I also put in some stu stools because you know, I imagine gift wrapping to be quite a labor of love So Abel and Sable deserve a place to sit when doing this And we obviously need some scissors and stuff like that too. And I also thought it would be nice to put in some little trinkets, maybe some toys that still needed to be wrapped. 
and I'm putting in some more stools. And can I say that I've never noticed the sound it makes when you're dragging it across the snow. It is such a satisfying sound. Just listen. Isn't that satisfying? But I am also placing some little trinkets on the stools here. Not to sit on it. But hey, this was a labor of love too. I deserve to take a little bit of a break too. I did my very best at this build. And I also wanted to include this custom code yet again. I just simply love this and I think it's so original. The wrapping paper code. And I'm also dropping another roll of wrapping paper here. And another sewing box that maybe includes tape or something. Now I also thought these playing party lights arch would frame in the entryway to Able Sisters nicely. And I'm also going in with some more storefronts to border in the left side of Able's to make it really feel inclusive. And I know, I know there's a balloon. Don't you worry. I am going to pop it. Because I know, I know I said I was going to do a little bit of a scavenger hunt present themed on my island. And, you know, that alone is a good enough reason to pop a present whenever I can. I mean, pop a balloon. But considering this is a gift wrapping station, it even makes more sense to have one here. So that was a happy, happy coincidence and just pure luck. And the last thing I'm going to do is put in some light foliage. I'm not going to go too crazy in this build because of time management. I do have plans today, so I don't have a whole lot of time to edit this. So I couldn't go extravagant with a whole lot of foliage and a very, very big build. But I did want to put out a video today. So I'm just going to fill up some spots just so that you have an idea of what it would could look like once this build is completely decorated And that is the end result I'm gonna leave you now. Thank you for watching. Be sure to hit the like, subscribe, and notification bell. And see you on the next one. Bye bye.